everyone this is as marif today welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorial today i'll show you how to edit a photo and add the cinematic effect okay let's go at first go to the file and then open i downloaded a picture from the unsplash.com this one is a stock image i'll give you the stock image link on my video description don't forget to check it out and don't forget to subscribe okay fine then this one is a nice picture okay make a copy by pressing ctrl j and go to the filter and then the camera filter i'll show you a basic edit of this photo uh, and the cinematic effect at first you have to reduce the vibrance okay after reducing the vibrance you have to go camera calibration and give the hue like that the hue will be the high minus 100 percent and make it the saturated okay that's good and the green you can give it like that and increase this the saturation and red like that okay that's good and go to the sharpening option and add some sharp of amount and then add some luminance reduce and then go to the SSL SSL is a uh, huge saturation and luminance and I'll increase the color of orange decrease the color of blue and the saturation I'll decrease the green and the aqua also okay after that go to the hue and make the red color like that and give the saturation of red and reduce the luminance of red and then hit the ok button let's see what was the previous and the present okay after that i will add some smoke over there i have to go to the new layer like that create a new layer and then go to the filter actually i'll go to the brush options here is some smoke options I'll increase the brush size don't worry I'll give the brush download link in my video description so you have to check it out okay uh, it's too much and then again I'm just taking a new blank layer and add some the cloud over here let's use at once okay i have to make it foggy actually just make it down okay move here and then take a new layer and go to the brush again and take the first brush and make it white and just press here press Ctrl T and just make it bigger like that. Okay, after that, go to the color lookup option, add the horror blue color and make it the soft light and make it like that. And I will reduce the opacity of the cloud and make it bigger more bigger like that and you can increase the opposite now okay like that hit the ok button and decrease the luminance a feel of the color lookup options and just go to the level and decrease like that okay and then make it group by pressing ctrl G and make it merge turn it off and work with this layer go to the filter and the nick collection color effects pro okay it's loading our color effects pro 4 is loading Okay, here is I am using the cross-processing 
and then here is the effect and apply it okay it will take time let's wait nice and let's see what was the previous one this one is the previous one and like the raw image if you want to add the semantic effect you can follow this process it's too much easy to use and don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching and i am asmr signing out and bye bye